All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the obligatory uh, picture collecting video. This is not something I'm looking forward to, but it's a necessary evil. Um, mostly because it's a half hour of me picking up pictures. Uh, the reason why I'm doing this, and why I'm not just skipping over the fact that I, you know, spent several hours collecting pictures, uh, <laughs> it's because if I don't show off, like, where they are or how I got them, I'm gonna get yelled at, but if I do show it off, I'm gonna get yelled at because this is, like, a bunch of non uh, like, non-content, so it's like, which side do I really want to get yelled at more? Um, and, uh, apparently I'm swapping out Riku here. Anyway, I decided that I might as well just, you know, upload it at least, like, segmented versions of me collecting the picture where the, or which piece it is and whatnot. I mean, it was either I spend, I do a half hour video of me just collecting video, uh, pictures, or I try and split up, like, I think it was, like, close to nine hours worth of stuff, like, uh, extra additional content outside of, um, outside of, no, even with the grinding, it would have been, like, ten hours, and that would have been, like, uh, oh, like, twenty videos of me just doing literally nothing, so... I thought, I think this is a little bit easier, a little, a uh, little nicer. Luckily, I was able to shove everything, all the, most of the pictures, pieces that I found were actually, uh, throughout the game, so I wasn't, I didn't have too many to go collect, but, um, and I can use stuff like that, so I don't even need glide. I think, for the most part, uh, all, a lot of these are going to be connected. Oh, wait, uh, before I start rambling, there was a second piece that was down here that I for some reason forgot to record uh, so I did it I got I think it's his face yeah that's the one uh, I, I got it the same way I did the last picture I just didn't fucking record it because I'm an idiot uh, I think I, yeah it was the one down here as I yeah show it off anyway back to my rant um, that I can't even remember Oh yeah, so most of these, uh, most of the collecting is going to be across from like seven different recording sessions, um, because I went in going, okay, I can totally get all of this shit done, and then uh, found out that specific puzzle pieces can't be get, uh, you can't get them without specific movement tech. Um, oh, <laughs> this is the, uh, yeah, <laughs> it's a penis, lol, 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 lol. Anyway, uh... <laughs> Anyway, going back to my conversation, as I keep sidetracking myself, uh, most of this is like a collection, a collage, if you will, of like seven different videos, um, because I kept like recording and then I found out that I needed specific movement tech in order to get certain pictures, and then after that I found out that I had a grind, and then I, like, one of the pictures I got was during my grinding session, because, uh, like you saw in the previous, like the beginning picture, I had to use the berserk movement tech, the like the berserk reaction command to get up there towards the picture. Um, I, I, and I did that off camera, going, "Oh, perfect! I got this picture." And then I went, "Oh wait, fuck! I didn't fucking record it. God damn it!" It was a little annoying, but I'm not sure too many too many people are gonna get super pissed off. Uh, I still have to show that picture piece that I, yeah, here's the picture piece that I just got. Uh, I think it's Sora's neck. I think I, I'm pretty sure I got all of the pictures done, um, if you're wondering. For the most part, I got a lot of the pieces, the pieces, uh, throughout the game, which is nice. But most of them you can't get until you get Glide, which get, which got really annoying. Here, I actually, I think I make the Shock Charm and the Moon Amulet. Um, I think by the end of the game I get like everything besides Frozen Pride and Shadow Arc. No, Frozen Pride and the Draw Ring, I think. I don't remember building the Draw Ring, but uh, I think I do build the Moon Amulet and the Shock Charm. I'm double checking to see if they use any of the items uh, for the Ultimate Keyblade, which I did build. Uh, I used it in the final fight, which I have already recorded as of this video. Um, I guess I don't make the moon amulet. 
the shock charm replaces the uh, protect belt because he gives you plus 40% uh, thunder damage. Which is okay, but I'm pretty sure I just replace it later because I get a super awesome weapon. Um, I think from completing the last the uh, sunset picture, it's like I think it's a plus four and then gives like 20% or 10% damage resistance to everything. And I was like, uh, yes, I can finally get this stupid piece from Beast Castle from uh, seeing it like there for like hours on end, piss pissing me off. I think there's one here, there's one in, um, uh, Land of the Dragons that I couldn't get for a while, because I needed to, um, I need to glide level 3, I think, or, it's either glide level 3 or glide level, uh, 2. Either way, I still have to level it up, or I still had to at the time. Um, what else was there? There was, uh, a few in, I think it's Port Royal. And the uh, uh, the world that never was. There are two of them that I kind of cheesed. Um, oh, this fucking section. So there were a few really annoying Jack uh, Jack in the boxes that kept knocking me off. So I went into Valor form for like two seconds, and then three more of them spawned. The second I reverted back into normal, it was like, God damn it, are you serious? Anyway, Port Royale and the world that never was has two picture pieces, uh, one in each world. Uh, that I couldn't reach unless I did like this sort of I'd call it a cheese I flew up or jumped up in certain cases and then I hit the back of the wall and the 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 effect of me like bouncing off the wall uh, actually knocked me into the puzzle piece which was really useful I was I was so confused on where this piece was because it's I think it's Goofy's chest but it's got Kyrie's hair and I was like wait a second <laughs> wait what's going on <laughs> How does this work? This magical piece, I don't understand. I think I've already mentioned this, but this picture looks really, really weird. Uh, just because I don't know who Kyrie's holding hands with. Because you can see someone's holding their hand uh, on the left side. Um, and here I'm like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> I couldn't, I for some reason didn't know that was uh, Gooby's, uh, his like s jumper and uh, coat. Um, but yeah, so I got all the picture pieces, but it took a while, as you can tell. And then I think next were... Oh, the old mansion, yes, this one. This one I needed, I think, either some sort of die, uh, some sort of glide level, and, or the aerial. No, I need a glide. Either that or level 3 might have, level 3 aerial dodge might have worked. Might have, I'm not too sure about that. And this is uh, Roxas's face. I think what confuses me the most is I'm not sure who she's holding hands with because it's a blonde-haired girl, or it's it's a blonde-haired person, but they're wearing the coat. And uh, Larkseen's a bitch, so I don't think it's Larkseen. Roxas is standing next to us. The only one that I could think about is Riku, but I don't know. I don't know, the hair doesn't look right for Riku, which makes you think she's holding her hands with Larxene, and that confuses the fuck out of me. Like, I've never seen Larxene and Kyrie in the same room, mostly because I killed Larxene and Rechain, so she became non-existent. <laughs> it's weird. I can probably Google it. I have, like, so much time. <laughs> uh, let's see, Sunset... Photo, uh... No, I, I want the Kingdom Hearts version. If you, if you will. Yes, the puzzles. Um... Come on. Where is it? It's the highest ribbon that I get. But who is this? It, okay, it's Riku. That makes... I was gonna say, look, she's a bitch, so no one would want to hold hands with her. Uh... <laughs> But the hair color for him, it looks too blondish. He's always been like gray hair, or at least he's uh, hes always looked like he has gray hair. So seeing him wear with like blonde hair confused the fuck out of me. Alright, so it is, it is good old Riku. The letter said this is all out of sync, I'm well aware. 
And by sync, I mean, uh, hopefully not the audio, but <laughs> the puzzle collecting. Am I now trying to figure out where goo? No, okay. Oh yeah, this room. So there are some picture pieces that I don't like. I don't know if this puzzle piece is in the actual boss fight. I think it might be. I think you can grab this during the boss fight. But I fought the boss like right next to the door, so I had no idea about it. So I spent like the longest time going, where the fuck is this piece? And stumbled across the boss room and went, oh, it's right here? Are you kidding me? And I'm pretty sure this is Syax's body, but I gave it to Zigbar because I'm smart. Um, I think the next one is the puzzle piece right near the beginning of the, uh, the, the world where we first enter. And we needed, I think, level, level 3 glide. I think we needed it, but I speed up the whole fight section. I tried, uh, oh, that's when I maxed out level, uh, 3 for, for that. Getting final form was a complete another bitch. I think I've already rambled about this in the last two videos because I'm s smart. Oh yeah, that's right, I have to mention. Your max level for form is 7, I think I've already mentioned that. But for some reason, the form has the high jump max while Sora can only use high jump level 3. It's such a weird little thing. Because you would think that Sora would be able to get like high jump max, but, but no. Uh, this should be Zigbar's body. Yep. Not bad, not bad. Um, I was gonna ramble about something. Ah, oh, here's the section I was talking about. So, I cannot reach this uh, as of yet. So I go into Valor form because I think at this point I had high jump max, and I can just barely reach it. And I was really confused, like, how I'm supposed to do this, because I think you're supposed to use, like, aerial dodge. Um, but I kind of cheesed this a little. Uh, I ended up hitting a wall, I think. And getting bounced off. Which was really, really weird. Yeah, right there. Yeah. I'm pretty sure that's not how you're supposed to get it, but it worked, so I'm keeping it. And that actually sparked an idea for the one in the world that never was. Because I was like, oh wait, can I do this for other puzzle pieces, or... And if so, which ones? So I kept, uh... I kept trying. The Wooden Land of the Dragons doesn't have a wall I can bounce off of. Uh, that last piece, I need level 3 glide. Like I said, getting final form was a complete and utter bitch, as I've mentioned several times. I think that was what I was trying to ramble about. The fact that I spent, like, hours going into, like, Valor form with three, uh, form gauges to find out that I need five, I need to be in con- there's, like, such a huge list. Um, here's the one in The World That Never Was that took me several attempts, which is why I'm speeding this section up. Because the, uh, there's some invisible walls that will knock you out of the way if you go down the wrong path. And this isn't with maxed out level stuff, this is like, level 1 glide, I think. But yeah, if you just hit the wall, you just bounce right into it. Of course it took a few attempts as you, as you saw. See, the, the hair looks like Lurkseen, but but it's not. <laughs> and I think this was when I was realizing that uh, Goofy had, uh, that was Goofy's body. This one I did in a very similar manner, uh, speeding up all my field attempts because I don't want to bore you guys too much in a photo collecting montage. I actually got stuck in the wall there for quite a while. The flying can get a little weird, I, uh, like, it's okay, but the flying can get dodgy at times. Because sometimes Sora just, like, fears right when, you're, when you don't want him to, and you're like, what are you doing? <laughs> no, come back. I do show off completing, I think, both pictures that I have left. Uh, this is the last two in the underworld. I think I could have got these a while ago, but I just never did. There were a few that I was like, oh, I'm just an idiot that I could have done that years ago. Um, but I, I was supposed to complete the, which one is it? It's not the Goddess of Fate, it's the, the, the Titan Cup. Uh, I could have come back and actually completed it on a live recording session. But I, I did complete it in a... Because I needed to, actually. I needed to do the Goddess of Fate in order to get uh, the Auriculum Plus for my Keyblade. 
lot of work to get that stupid keyblade. <laughs> I'm just glad it wasn't like you have to complete the entire journal, because I would have said, fuck that. The missions in this game are like... It's hard. <laughs> they are not easy missions. Because there was one where you had to get a... It's, you have to redo the mission, like the, the jobs back in Twilight Town, and you have to get to a certain like time limit in order for it to kind of be as finished. Uh, and the one where you the, the, to get the payload up the hill, um, that took me like several attempts <laughs> because you have to get it like in 20 seconds, I think, or something like that. I kept getting like 21. It was frustrating. That's why I'm not, I'm not completing the journal. Not 100%. I think I get close to it, but I'm not not going here all the way. Oh, this one, uh, the, this was, I, I was a little self-aware in this uh, fight. Because if I fly off the edge, I had to go all the way back to go through the door just to get this one puzzle piece. Uh, but I think I spent, I spent some time screwing around, uh, looking at other things, which is why I get straight to the pictures. This actually looks so small. <laughs> like, holy crap. We still haven't finished duality. That's how f that's how long ago this is. <laughs> and yeah, see, I haven't even completed sunset. Not even close. At this point in the recording. Uh, okay. Should have had a yeah, nice nice rough cut there. No worries. There's a duality piece. <laughs> I don't know when I would have been able to get that because I think when do you get master? I forgot. This game is so fucking long. Uh. To master form. I forgot when you get the actual form. It, I know you get it after wisdom. I think the king gives it to you. Yeah, and Hollow Bastion. Um, so that's like way later than this uh, thing. So I wouldn't have been able to use the aerial dodge anyway. Maybe my high jump was supposed to be like higher, high enough. You'll notice I'm not gliding because I don't actually have glide. <laughs> Well, at this point. Like I said, a lot of these recording sessions were cut up and uh, smushed together. I think I came back to the castle because of the Lingering Will. Uh, I did not complete the Lingering Will, but it's in the game and it's in the castle and I went to go look for it. Um, for those who don't know what the Lingering Will is, it's a, uh, it's a character from another game that hasn't... As of the... Uh, the game being released, the character wasn't actually uh, released or announced. If that makes any sense, he's in a the prequel, which is which came out. Okay, he's in the prequel of uh, Kingdom Hearts, which came after Kingdom Hearts 2. If that makes any sense. He's a character from Birthday Sleep, which is the prequel. I think here I'm trying to glide over to this. This is still level one glide. <laughs> so I was like, oh fuck. We're not even close. Uh, but yeah, Lingering Will. That's a, it's a boss fight, essentially, of a character from another from a, the prequel, as I said. And I am not going to be doing it. Mostly because uh, I got my ass kicked by the data replicas, and it's supposed to be on the same level as the data replicas. So this is me showing off that I've maxed out Father, Master, and Final Form. Showing off that I have... Uh, Level 3 of everything. Glide, aerial dodge, and high jump. I will not be doing... I will not be maxing out uh, limit, summons, or... Um, wisdom form. Mostly because I have a, I have higher strength than magic, so... It would have taken me more time to level up uh, wisdom form. I was like, what the hell am I missing? Oh, it's Riku's chest there. I thought I was supposed to turn them around, um, but that's for sunset. Oh, look at look at all those pictures done. <laughs> so good. You'll have no idea like how how rewarding it is to to feel like oh fuck I got all of the things in the entire game. It's so good. And then I was I was gonna do the same with all the treasure chests, uh, but then I found out where the last treasure chest is, and I was like nope fuck that. <laughs> I'll talk more about that in the, the Cave of Remembrance video because uh, the last the last couple chests that I need in the game are in Hollow Bastion, specifically the Cave of Remembrance. And the, the very last one is very, very hard to get. 
probably like incredibly worth it, but I don't know. I'm not going to be uh, struggling my, you know, spending hours on end trying to get this, that last treasure chest. At least not on camera. There's Zigbar's arm. I think I may have missed a few, uh, few pictures. <laughs> not by, like, pieces, but showing off which pieces, which, um, I know, super important, right? At least I'm showing me my, I'm, at least I'm showing off the fact that I'm getting all these pictures. Oh yeah, by the way, they rebuilt the town and, uh, the town that was destroyed and then uh, got rebuilt. Yeah. I don't remember if they ever, if we've ever seen that. Because I think in the second visit it would should have been still destroyed. Oh, remember this area? I was just here. <laughs> I don't know why I cut those two pieces up. <laughs> oh, I guess this is after I got to glide. Oh, this is before I got glide, I should say. I just blew up at one of our tents. Good job. Looking after the people by blowing their shit up. Uh, this is the duality piece? Our oh, heart. Okay. Have I not finished the heart picture? I guess I finish it now. It's been like a couple days since I've recorded any of this. Oh, that's right. It pieced it in perfectly. Got the serenity crystal from it. I think I was missing that last one piece. Um. Okay. Yeah, look at that. I was missing everything at this point. Oh, God. I think this is me planning on going to the castle, or the uh, castle, the palace. Um, pretty sure I can't get that because I need Glide, as we just saw. I'm piecing things together as I, as I watch it, don't worry. Things that have already happened, I'm, I'm telling you. <laughs> I'm gonna show off that I cannot get it without Glide. Yeah, like I said, Final Form was a bitch to get. <laughs> it took me hours. Because <laughs> I forgot the, the requirements. The fact that you need to be in combat with five drive bars, uh, using the two become one keyblade, and if you turn it into anti-form, you then have to re-grind out the, the drive, the drive gauges, unless you have drive recoveries, which I never had the items to, uh, to actually build it, which was frustrating. So I did everything without drive recoveries. Uh, this is the one that's been like stuck all the way here. There it is. Daylight puzzle piece. Uh, I think this is one of the last daylight pieces, right? If not the last. Yeah, it is. And it's Laxius's head. Oh, the ex uh, executive's ring. So it says it gives you a large amount of... Uh, uh, of AP, and I was like, okay, an excessive amount of AP, what would that be, like, 5, or 10, or 8, I don't know. Uh, it turns out it's, uh, 30. <laughs> so, it was pretty crazy. I'm pretty sure I have one item. Yeah, it's 30 AP, just 30 straight up AP. <laughs> I was like, holy fuck, are you serious? Uh, I think, yeah, the cost of wearing is plus 8. So I was like, okay, we'll upgrade that. <laughs> holy shit. Seeing if Gooby or uh, Doland needs a ring that can give me 8 AP. I do also show off the, the skills that I put up, uh, put into it. I think it's Jackpot. No, not yeah, Jackpot. Uh, combination boost, maybe? No. Form boost. Yes. Berserker charge, I think I get. Um, I already got all the combo pluses. I think I go Trinity Limit. I think I was done. Yeah. Item boost? Sure, why not? <laughs> As a drive converter, you know, oddly enough, I forgot to put drive converter on while I was trying to max out my, uh, um, whatchamacallit, my master form. Like, I didn't have that on, on at all, which probably would have made grinding that out much easier. <laughs> because, holy shit. <laughs> Because for those who don't remember, Master Form levels up off of the uh, it levels up 
Uh, one experience point is the small little drive orbs, while three is the bigger orbs. Uh, so if I had that on, it would have made things a little bit quicker. I'm not sure I got the goofy, uh, the Dolan face, but it's there. <laughs> I have collected it. Now I just have to go with uh, Radiant Garden. I think that might have been the one from the uh, middle of town. And most of the Radiant Garden pictures are going to be shown during the Cave of Remembrance section because most of those pictures, besides this one, which I apparently forgot, um, are in the Cave of Remembrance, which is going to be a complete and like a complete video by itself. Because um, yes, that room is pretty much. It's that important, I won't be completing it all the way through, but I wanted to explore it, to say the least. I made it, in my own personal uh, playthrough before recording this, uh, I got all the way up to the last uh, section of pipes, which I'll talk about in the video. I got up to there, uh, no, it was, it was the last section with pipes, and I was really, really close to the end of the door. Um, but I couldn't get in because uh, it was blocking my way, which was fucking annoying. This is, uh... I wasn't sure what this was. There's Zeminus at the bottom. Yeah. Oh, and Lux got his face. <laughs> but it should be the one at the bottom. I'm not gonna remember that. Okay, good. Good job. Good job.